Thank you very much, Randy. And um, you know, I've been to a lot of commencements, and uh, this year in my new role, I have to, with five campuses, I'm at seven commencements. But I have never seen a faculty member step in as effectively as Jackie Einstein does. She's a professor of business. Would you please stand, Jackie? That was really, really special. Uh, to, to Dean Gunnar, to um, Chancellor Helm, uh, Trustee Ed Collins, uh, Trustee Henry Thomas, uh, outstanding members of the faculty, distinguished guests, family and friends, and most importantly, to the class of 2016, congratulations to each and every one of you. You are graduating from a great institution. The University of Massachusetts Dartmouth is a fabulous institution that has been recognized as in the top 2% of universities in the United States by President Obama because of its commitment to community service, making the national honor roll for community service year after year after year. And that's because of over 200,000 hours that graduates and students at this university put in in trying to help public service and help organizations within the South Coast. So I congratulate all of you on that. I also want to say to graduates, this is an ever-changing world. It's changing rapidly. My father was a compositor at the local Lowell Sun Publishing Company. He was in the same job for 43 years as a linotype operator. That technology today is completely gone. Technology is changing rapidly. If you look at the jobs that are being advertised around the state and around the country, over the next five to six to seven years, they're going to change dramatically again. So while I congratulate each and every one of you on graduating from this institution today, you need to be committed to lifelong learning. There is no such thing as stopping your education, whether it's advancing to get an advanced degree, whether it's advancing and taking certificate programs, or whether it's just being committed, as all of you must be, to lifelong learning. Your ability to achieve your full potential in life will be directly tied to your intellectual curiosity and your commitment to lifetime learning. I know that each and every one of you, because of your accomplishment, have the tools, have the skills that you need to accomplish whatever that you set out to accomplish in your life. And I know that because, as uh, Chancellor Helm said, I'm a graduate of the University of Massachusetts at the Lowell campus. I know the quality of the faculty at the University of Massachusetts. I know the quality of the students. I know the grit and the work ethic at this campus. And I know that there's nothing that you can't achieve if you put your heart and mind and soul into your work. So be committed to lifetime learning, but also be committed to the University of Massachusetts Dartmouth. We need to have you engaged and involved with this university looking into the future. So I would challenge each and every one of you to come back to the campus, to be engaged with us. If you get a job, you might want to write a little check for scholarships so that others after you can attend this university. But be engaged with this university. And finally, I want to say that you have sent and Jacob Miller, an outstanding student trustee uh, to the University of Massachusetts. I have worked with him. He's been a leader for this campus. And I uh, just want to recognize your student trustee, Jacob Miller, who is fabulous. <laughs> so with that, let's continue and have a great day. Congratulations to all of you.